So we're going to ask, you know, Ted, then how do we part the Red Sea? How do we part the Red Sea? <laughs> um, not quite documented how um, it really happened. Um, it was winds, it was weather, it was like a shoal. Um, and they walked on this. It was not um, something um, where you have these big walls of, um, you know, water and then dry land and you're walking across the Red Sea, you know, on the bottom. Um, didn't happen like that. That's not accurate how documented there. But we did, wherever we could, use technology and we had advanced starships in orbit and we were bringing shuttles down to the surface and we had secret base camps with angels that were spiritual living things and also to physical living things that were like mankind or almost like human, you know, that were on World Earth Two that uh, were part of the cover-up and were working on um, the side of God and the host and we had huge advanced starships in orbit for a while at that point in time when we could. Um, now uh, these would be easily detected and we can't do that anymore. And uh, some are wondering why then would we and did we and are we advancing the technology this rapidly on world earth then? We're doing it that we can drop or kill Satan and the demons. God and the host advance the technology enormously at an enormously rapid rate. We taught you things much quicker than we would have normally. God and the host put nuclear missiles on world earth. Nuclear missiles are here for a reason. These are to help us deliver the fire. Nuclear missiles are supposed to be the fire. And therefore we had to advance all types of technology on world earth to get ready for this time that we could drop or kill Satan the demons and now we have spawns of those. And those have thwarted us and we are, um, have been delayed and we're still trying to make the fire happen in this coming. That's why we coined the word or phrase of incoming. And we've coined many phrases and words and uh, phrases like I am born again a Christian, I am a born again Christian, many I am's in the lifetime of Ted, I am here, I am right here, I have come back, this is my comeback, I am having a comeback, I am on a comeback, many different phrases were coined and were sent to you subtly, including in sports, through sports announcers, and that's true.